Hey guys, how's it going? I thought I'd show you this project uh, that I've been working on. Uh, so I've been modeling out these, um, these these cells that represent like B cells and T cells and uh, cancer cells and that sort of thing. Uh, and I got them over here in the, uh, the magic leap that I'm wearing. And it's a lot of fun because the magic leap actually scans the, uh, the environment that you're in. And I enabled physics on these things so I can actually hit them and they bounce off the environment here, uh, which is super fun. Uh, but in order to get them into the environment, uh, I did this little gesture where you can pinch and you can drag one out. Which is fun. And then these things, like I said, are physics enabled so they can bounce off uh, the environment and each other. Which, I must say, I, I find endlessly amusing. Uh, yeah, so there's uh, there's another spot to this thing. Uh, let me get rid of that. Uh, so up here on the uh, the screen, I've got a web page. And I've got a WebSocket connection from the, uh, the Magic Leap on my face over to uh, this browser window. And what I can do with this controller is I can uh, just point at one of these things. And I can drag it off of the uh, the screen. Um, so it's a little rough around the edges, but uh, I think I think it's showing promise. I can just pull them straight out of the screen, which is fun. Uh, and the cool thing is, what's happening on the uh, the screen is, you know, it's actually on the screen. So people that aren't wearing the uh, the goggles can still see that. Um, so. Uh, another thing that I set up here was uh, I don't necessarily have to do it with the uh, the controller. I can also use the the hand gestures. So let's see, give this a shot. I'm gonna reach over here and I'm gonna try to pull that out. Yeah. Let's see if I can grab this. So just pull it straight out of the screen. Yeah. Uh, anyway, I think it's uh, it's really interesting to be. Uh, Making making these things spatially uh, aware of each other, you know, the magic leap knows where the screen is and vice versa So then we can communicate between them and do things like pull things out of this screen or uh, You know hypothetically take this thing and put it back on that screen or, or something like that In any case, uh, I think it's it's interesting territory and uh, Yeah, so I'll talk to you guys later